What's up, guys? We're finally back. I had some technical difficulties, and I couldn't shoot. Um, something about the memory on my phone. Um, certain videos would save, other videos wouldn't save, but I finally got that figured out. Um, and then the videos that I was able to get, I couldn't edit. So clearly there was something wrong with my phone. But got it all figured out. I do have some clips from this week. I'm going to try to give you guys at least one. Um, my goal is to do two to three uh, vlogs a week. Um, today, I get to, even though most of you have already seen on my social media, I, um, we have some goats. And uh, they are awesome. So we did the fence here a little bit. Um, my little cousin helped me uh, put the fence all the way around. So we were exhausted. Um, I got to finish up the inside of the barn here. Um, but I'm going to show you guys the goats. Here they are. They knocked over all the panels. Of course they did. Let me turn on light here. What's up, girls? So, this is Julieta. That's Baca. It means cow in Spanish. And this is Carol Basket. Blondie. Uh, super, super friendly. But, um, what we're going to be doing today, actually, is uh, we're going to be transplanting the veggies. My veggie garden is huge. Um, very, very, very excited. So I'm going to show you guys the process, why we do it, and that kind of stuff. Um, also, I'm going to be showing you some highlights from the week, from the videos that I was able to get, like me hauling all this wood in here. It's like, a, like 10 uh, pressure-treated plywood, all this uh, two by fours, I think is 18 of them or something like that. Um, we're going to cover the inside of this barn here and then we're going to make a chicken coop. So, um, I'll show you guys those highlights, but today is about, also I put in, uh, I put together my son's crib. It was one of the coolest moments. Um, he got to sleep in his crib for the first night. Um, it took me about an hour to put the crib together, but I sped it up for you guys. Um, pretty cool it's been a it's been an awesome week hope you guys enjoy um the video i'll show you guys little clips of the week so cool goats are out i don't have to worry about keeping an eye on them i'm gonna go get them some fresh water but a lot of people actually have been saying like hey carlos so like why'd you start doing this and well, in Venezuela, we always, I grew up in like, a, um, in the city, but my dad had land kind of like further out and we had animals, goats, chickens, pigs, dogs. Um, I think everything except horse. So, um, I grew up on it and with this whole fear of scarcity, um, through the, quarantine um feels kind of nice to know that regardless what's out in the supermarket we have enough to eat here veggies and protein so um feels nice to know that you could provide so plus i enjoy it so why not got Fresh water for the goats. The dogs are running around. And speaking of dogs, we may be having puppies soon. So, exciting news. We may be having a litter of German Shepherds. So, keep you guys posted on that.
I'm going to show you guys where my garden is going to be and what I'm doing there right now. Um, come here, girls. I want to make sure the dogs don't spook them. So, call me corny, but isn't that super cool? So, obviously there is grass right now where I want to put my garden. But I put a little fence around it. I put the chicks out there. I let a couple of the rabbits go. Obviously they're gonna tear up the grass, but um, as they ruin the grass, they're fertilizing the ground. So feed the chickens, feed the rabbits. They till up the dirt, they fertilize it. And then I plant my veggies. I have to do practically almost no work. So work smart, not hard, I guess. Look at this. So we got a bunny, another little bunny, and then we have our chicks. Part of the the reason why I really, really like um, doing all this and the homestead and lifestyle and everything is because you don't waste anything. So instead of me just digging up that dirt there, um, I put my rabbits and my chickens out there. They get to eat, they do the work for me, and uh, it's less money I spend on feed for them. So it's just kind of like a cycle that one thing feeds the next. So time to get to transplanting these veggies, and uh, that's going to be my Sunday. I pulled the first squash out of the, the, the plug tray here and even though the plant is like really big and tall, um, the roots aren't quite as strong as I want them. So I'm going to take a big chance here and I'm going to leave it. I'm not going to translate these, uh, the squash and the beans. I'm going to leave them in there for another week or two and I'm just going to put them out in the garden. Caleb. What do you think? What do you think, bud? You like it? Look at all this room for activities. Oh, yeah, big boy. Want to give a kiss to me, puppy? Hey, puppy, tough. Big boy. Becca, come here. Blondie, come here. Good. Julieta. Hey, Julieta. Julieta, come here. Come up here. Come on. All right, all right. Break's over. Back to work. There you go. Enjoy that apple. Let's go. <laughs> and in they go. Good job.